रिसर्च मेथोडोलॉजी एंड स्टेटिस्टिक के ऊपर यह दूसरा वीडियो है पी एस एग्जाम में पूछे गए कुछ क्वेश्चंस को हम इस वीडियो में सॉल्व करने वाले हैं तो आइए इस वीडियो की शुरुआत करते हैं आयुर्वेदिक रिसर्च मेथड्स आर बेस्ड ऑन फॉलोइंग मेथड्स रैंडमाइजेशन इंडक्टिव एंड डिडक्टिव ड्रग डिसीज मॉडल ऑल ऑफ द अबाव सो आयुर्वेदिक रिसर्च मेथड्स दे आर बेस्ड ऑन द इंडक्टिव एंड डिडक्टिव मेथड इंडक्टिव मेथड मीन्स बेस्ड ऑन द ऑब्जर्वेशन देर इज अ रिकग्निशन ऑफ पैटर्न एंड कंक्लूजन इज ड्रॉन इट इज इंडक्टिव मेथड एंड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ एग्जिस्टिंग थियोरी फॉर्मुलेशन ऑफ हाइपोथेसिस एंड फॉर दैट द डेटा इज कलेक्टेड एनालाइज एंड द एक्सेप्टेड हाइपोथेसिस इज एक्सेप्टेड और रिजेक्टेड दिस इज डिडक्टिव मेथड सो आयुर्वेदिक रिसर्च मेथड्स बेस्ड ऑन द इंडक्टिव एंड डिडक्टिव मेथड बी इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन वन ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट इज नॉट ट्रू रिगार्डिंग द कंपोजिशन ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूशनल इथिकल इथिक्स कमेटी एटलीस्ट फाइव टू सेवन मेंबर्स आर रिक्वायर्ड एटलीस्ट वन मेंबर आउटसाइड द इंस्टीट्यूट वन मेंबर इज एक्सपीरियंस्ड लॉयर और जज एटलीस्ट वन मेंबर मस्ट बी फीमेल सो इन कंपोजिशन ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूशनल इथिक्स कमेटी देर आर सेवन मेंबर्स अप्रोक्सीमेटली मैक्सिमम ट्वेल्व टू फिफ्टीन मेंबर्स आर देर वन मेडिकल साइंटिस्ट वन क्लिनिशियन वन लीगल एक्सपर्ट आइदर लॉयर और जज वन फिलोसोफर और इथिसिस्ट एंड वन ले पर्सन विच इज नॉट एफिलिएटेड टू दैट इंस्टीट्यूट एंड मेंबर सेक्रेटरी विच इज एफिलिएटेड टू इंस्टीट्यूट एंड चेयर पर्सन इज नॉन एफिलिएटेड आउटसाइड द इंस्टीट्यूट सो हियर एटलीस्ट वन मेंबर मस्ट बी फीमेल इट इज रॉन्ग स्टेटमेंट डी इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन Following is the base of all pramana for research in Ayurveda. Pratyaksha anuman yukti aptobdesh. Tatra aptobdesho naam aptavechanam. Aptobdesh jo apta hai, uska vachan aptobdesh kaha jata hai. And it is the base of all pramana, as any research work begins from the existing knowledge. Or jiske pas knowledge hai. ट्रू नॉलेज है उसको आप तक कहा जाता है सो आप तो उपदेश ये सभी प्रमाण का बेस है डी इज द करेक्ट ऑप्शन विच वन ऑफ द फॉर्मिंग इज नॉट यूज इन क्वांटिटेटिव डेटा प्रेजेंटेशन हिस्टोग्राम डॉट डायग्राम फ्रीक्वेंसी कर्व एंड पाई डायग्राम फॉर क्वांटिटेटिव डेटा प्रेजेंटेशन नॉट यूज सो देर आर टू मेथड्स ऑफ डेटा प्रेजेंटेशन टेबुलेशन एंड ड्रॉइंग In tabulation, they may be presented as simple table, complex table, frequency distribution table, and master table. And in drawing, for qualitative data, diagrams are used, and for quantitative data presentation, graphs are used. So, for quantitative data, histogram is used, frequency polygon, frequency curve, line chart, cumulative frequency, and scatter or डॉट डायग्राम सो हियर नॉट यूज इन क्वांटिटेटिव डेटा प्रेजेंटेशन सो पाई डायग्राम इट इज यूज फॉर द प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ क्वालिटेटिव डेटा इट इज नॉट यूज फॉर द प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ क्वांटिटेटिव डेटा ऑल अदर थ्री मेथड दैट इज हिस्टोग्राम डॉट डायग्राम फ्रिक्वेंसी को दे आर यूज फॉर द प्रेजेंटेशन ऑफ क्वांटिटेटिव डेटा सो करेक्ट ऑप्शन इज पाई डायग्राम डी इन रिसर्च Covert study is also called as prevalence study, prospective study, case control study, animal study. So there are three methods of analytical study: case control study, covert study, and cross-sectional study. Case control study is retrospective study, that is study of past, also called as flashback study. Covert study it is prospective, that is study of future, also called as longitudinal study. And cross-sectional study is prevalence study, also called as horizontal study. so here covert study is also called as prospective study b is the correct option a research in which researcher has to use facts or information which is already available and analyze these to make critical evaluation of the material is called as descriptive research fundamental research analytical research and applied research so fundamental research is a research related with the fundamentals basic principles applied research it is the 
practical application of knowledge is applied research. Descriptive research includes surveys and fact findings, inquiries of different kind. And analytical research, here the researcher must use facts or information which is already available and analyze this to make a critical evaluation of the material is analytical research. So, correct answer is analytical research C. The data which is obtained from sources like journals, hospital records, etc. is called as primary data, secondary data, discrete data, continuous data. So, based on the source of collection, the data is of two types, primary data and secondary data. The primary data is collected afresh or for the first time, example, surveys, interviews or questionnaire. And secondary data is collected from sources such as journals, internet research articles, etc. So, here the data obtained from sources like journals, hospital record, it is secondary data, B is the correct option. One of the following is not a type of bar diagram, primary bar diagram, simple bar diagram, multiple bar diagram and proportional bar diagram. So, bar diagram, it is used to present a qualitative data and there are three types of bar diagram, simple bar diagram, multiple and proportional bar diagram. So, primary bar diagram is not a type of bar diagram, A is the correct option. The statement of research problem according to Ayurveda is Pratidnya Hetu Upanay Nigma Nigam Nigman. So a Panchavi Vakya Jo hai Pratidnya Hetu Udaran Upanay or Nigaman Uske Upar question hai. So statement of research problem is Pratidnya. Pratidnya Nama Sadhya Vachan Jo Sadhya Karna hai Usko Bolna Us statement ko kaha jata hai Pratidnya Yatha Nitya Purusha Hiti. So correct answer is Pratidnya. Pratidnya Nama Sadhya Vachana. A is the correct option. Controlled group is a term used in survey research, historical research, experimental research and descriptive research. So, observational research and interventional research are the two types of research. Observational research is, it is a non-experimental research or also called as epidemiological research and interventional research is experimental research or clinical research and in that experimental research the comparison can be made between experimental and controlled group. Controlled group means the group which receives standard drug or no treatment. So, this term is used for the experimental research or interventional research. C is the correct option. Which of the following is the first step in starting the research process? Searching sources of information to locate problem. Survey of related literature, selection of research problem and searching for solutions to the problem. So, first step in starting research is defining research problem or selection of research problem. C is the correct option. So, defining the problem is first stage, then planning the research design, selecting a sample, collection of data, analyzation of research data, drawing conclusion and preparing a report and follow up. These are the stages in the research process. So, first step is selection of research problem or defining a research problem. C is the correct option. Objective of research is searching again and again, finding solution to any problem, to discover the truth of any problem through the application of scientific procedures and none of the above. So, ob the objective of research is to discover the truth of any problem through the application of scientific procedures. C is the correct option. Which are the responsibilities of institutional ethical committee? Safety of proposed intervention in human, scientific soundness of proposed research, adequacy of qualification of investigators and all of the above. So, the responsibilities of the institutional ethical committee are the safety, rights and well-being of research participants, review of research proposals to ensure they are scientifically sound and ethical, review of suitability of investigators, also to ensure that the human subjects are treated ethically and ensuring the informed consent. So, all of the above is correct. Safety of the proposed intervention in human, scientific soundness of research proposal, 
and adequacy of qualification of investigator all are comes under responsibilities of institutional ethical committee d is the correct option what is placebo placebo is a dummy medication placebo is the inert material added to the drug for making tablet placebos do not produce any effect all patients respond to placebo so placebo is nothing but a dummy medication e is the correct option the abbreviation consort stands for concise statement for research trials concise statement for reporting trial consolidated standards of reporting trial and consolidated statement of reporting trial so consort stands for consolidated standards of reporting trials c is the correct option finer feasible interesting novel ethical and relevant consolidated standards of reporting trial which type of survey questions allow respondents to answer in their own words open ended survey questions closed ended survey questions a and b both none of the above so there are two types of survey questions open ended and closed ended questions closed ended survey questions is made up of pre populated answers choices options rehte hain usme usme se choose karna hai form for the respondent to choose from and open ended questions ask the respondent to provide feedback in their own words so open ended questions allows the respondent to answer in their own words a is the correct option which among the following is known as gold standard of clinical study o open labeled clinical trial single blind clinical trial randomized clinical trial and adaptive clinical trial so gold standard of clinical studies randomized clinical trials sorry randomized controlled trials controlled trials they are considered as the gold standard for clinical studies because they are the most reliable way to determine the safety and effectiveness of new treatments so it includes randomization blinding statistical analysis and sample size is also sufficiently large so randomized controlled trial is the correct option c evidence hierarchies have which of the following order case control study cohort study randomized trial meta analysis so evidence evidence hierarchies so weakest is case reports opinion reports papers and letters they are weakest after that animal trials and in vitro studies then cross sectional studies then case control studies then cohort studies then randomized control trials and last and strongest is meta analysis and systematic reviews so here correct out answer is weak is case control study then cohort study then randomized trials and then meta analysis a is the correct option data collected by the investigator himself or herself for the specific purpose is known as primary data secondary data true data empirical data so data collected by investigator himself or herself for the first time or for specific purpose is primary data it is also called as original data because it is collected for the first time by person who will use them so by researcher a is the correct option double blinding in clinical research may reduce which type of bias observer selection allocation record so in double blind study if researcher knows which group of participant is assigned to they might act in a way that reveals the assignment or directly influences the result this can also lead to biases particularly observer bias agar usko pata hai ki kaun sa drug de raha hai to observer bias usme aa sakta hai so double blinding study may reduce the observer bias e is the correct option which bias can be controlled by randomization observational bias selection bias measurement bias and analysis bias so by randomization is the method that can help to control selection bias which can occur when patients are assigned to a trial in a way that's not random so randomization prevent the selection bias b is the correct option in scientific writing presently which format refers to common organization structure of article that is adopted by most of the scientific journal article apa rnd jama im rd so Sign for scientific writing, the format is IMRD. IMRD: Introduction, Methods, Results, and Discussion. 
D is the correct option. Which central data value that occurs most frequently? Mean, median, mode, standard deviation. So, central data value that occurs most frequently is mode. C is the correct option. Which scales has the characteristic like order interval value true zero defined? Nominal ordinal interval ratio. So, ratio scales has characteristic like order interval value and true zero defined. Ratio scale is the correct option D. Which type of error in statistical analysis occurs when the null hypothesis is rejected and when it is actually true? Type 3, type 4, type 1, type 2. So, there are two types of hypothesis thesis testing errors type 1 and type 2 type 1 is also called as false positive and is occurs when the null hypothesis is rejected even though it is true so it is type 1 and type 2 is false negative that occurs when null hypothesis is not rejected even though it is false so null hypothesis is rejected when it is actually true is type 1 error c is the correct option which is the analytical step of knowledge discovery in databases? Informatics, statistics, data mining and database management. So, analytical step of the knowledge discovery in database is data mining. Data mining is the analytical phase of KDD that involves examining data to find patterns and trends. Data mining techniques are applied to transform data to discover hidden insights. So, correct answer is C, data mining. Find the term which interpreted as a spread of data around mean, range, standard deviation, standard error, central tendency. Spread of data around mean. The number of measures, number that measures how far data is spread around the mean is standard deviation. So, standard deviation is term used to interpret the spread of data around the mean. The small standard deviation value indicates that data is concentrated close to the mean and large standard deviation indicates that data is more spread out. So, correct answer is standard deviation. So, thank you very much friends. I hope so this video will be helpful for you. We will meet in the next video. Thank you once again.